and we're live. Yay. All right. Hello, hello. I am in downtown Las Vegas. I'm joined by my friend Nicole. Say hi, Nicole. Hi. How's it going, everybody? <laughs> What's up? So we are downtown and we are searching for the new Legends of Hogwarts foundables. I haven't seen a single one yet, but I haven't really played a lot today. Have you gotten some? I've gotten two of the Angelina. Two Angelina. Is it a, like a regular one or does it have a beam? It's a regular one. I okay. think it's a medium threat level. Okay, so there's, I think there's two severes, right? And I, then I one, no I think there's two severes and one high. I guess I could check it. Two five kilometers. See, I haven't been playing today. All right, let me look here. Let's see. Okay, I don't know who any of these people are. Okay, severe. This one's Angelina. Medium. High and severe okay so literally two of them are orange one of them is yellow and then the other one is not anything right okay so there is a oh i should have been in that lane oh well um there is a legends of hogwarts flag uh on fremont street so i want to go over there first actually to see if there's anything over there so there's a couple of flags here actually yeah we've got the um games and sports here and then we've got Box closed. I wonder if this is open. There's a lot of construction in Las Vegas right now, so <laughs> we never know. Uh, Which from streets are open. <laughs> yeah, from one day to the next, I like it changes. Sometimes, actually, I was doing a loop the other day, and on my second loop around, they had switched the lanes, so it was like I had to go in the <laughs> other lane. I'm like, I was just here like 30 seconds ago. This is not a thing. That's okay, fine. so yeah, this road is closed, but I can go to the right. Okay. Getting energy that I don't need. Now what? Let's see. Okay, so here, right up here is where the flag is. So hopefully we can see something, something new. I need something new. Yeah, I had to restart my app. My character was way back where we started. Oh, really? That happens <laughs> to me sometimes. It just like completely stops moving. Yeah. I don't know why though. I know. As it is with this game. Yeah, th this update seems pretty good though. Yes, that's true. Uh, I haven't had any problems. Yeah, or at least like the patch or whatever that they did. Right. Did you download your assets? I did. Okay. <laughs> someone someone mentioned it in the chat, and when they did, I was like, well, let me do it right now so I don't Before forget. Before you about forget. It. Yeah. Okay, so I don't see any Hogwarts stuff over here. That's stupid. Usually okay. there's like five or six. Oh, oh, it's still something I need. Hi, Calvin. Say hi to Calvin. Hi, Calvin. <laughs> What's up? He's probably not watching hockey anymore. But. <laughs> um, but yeah, honestly, like I'm thinking about all the stuff that I need to do before all these events. Holy crap. I right? <laughs> it's like stressing me out. There's um, too much going on. There really is. Oh, great. Oh, there's something. Hogwarts. Oh, no. It's just filch. But yeah, like I was thinking, like I want to get, I, I need to hoard more rune stones so that when we have that event focused on the potions one that I, because I don't have the the fortress fragment for that one done yet, the Half-Blood Prince or whatever, oh, the yeah. potions book. Mm -hmm. So I need to do that so then I can at least like prestige and everything. But yeah, I don't know, with this uh, brilliant event being delayed until Tuesday, I was really excited to... Oh, the Jets won the game. <laughs> oh, cool. Cool. Go sports ball. I don't, I don't know. I don't right, care about same. sports. <laughs> Which is bad. I, I actually... I, I used to live in Detroit and hockey was huge there. So oh, I should yeah. care, but... That's true. Oh, well. And we should care now that the Vegas Golden Knights are here. But... Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I was watching... Um, who was I watching? Uh, Wizard Way, Chris. She was saying, oh, I have to restart my app. Um, she was saying, because she was getting prepared for the Brilliant event when it was supposed to start yesterday. Um, and so she used her rented cauldron and she brewed two 
strong extimulo potions and two potent extimulo potions and then just left them there because uh, one of the tasks is to brew two strongs and then the next page there's a task to brew two potents. Oh geez, that's not good. Um, so then like if you leave it there then you still have access to your regular cauldron but then you will have them ready so you don't have to wait for them. So I think that's super smart. So I'm probably gonna do that on Monday. Oh no, don't do that. I don't wanna do that. Not right now. Okay. Yeah, the last time I tried to open a port key on a live stream, it totally crashed the stream. <laughs> yeah. Over and over again. I even tried like, I was like, oh no, this is interrupted. And then it turned out it was just, just didn't want to cooperate. Yeah, so no AR on the live stream. It breaks everything. But yeah, so this is the first time uh, Nicole has been on this loop that I always do. Um, any of you guys who watch like normally know that I always do the same loop. Um, but yeah, it's it goes through literally all of downtown. And I can get a decent amount of energy, so I don't know if you're like full on energy or not. Oh, there's a high. Ah, uh, I really want one of the new, <laughs> the new ones. ones. Yeah. It's just all the same stuff. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I should. I feel like it'd be a waste to use a tonic. Yeah. I don't have to. I want to save. I I just started brewing tonics again. I want to save up for another event where we need them. <laughs> right. I don't know. Brishton said he, he brewed a bunch and it was right before we needed them for the other event. Hi, Mike. How's it going? Thanks for being here. Hi, Mike. Nicole says hi. <laughs> if anybody's just tuning in, Nicole is with me right now. Uh, we are looping in downtown Las Vegas. We're looking for the new Hogwarts foundables, but I have not found one yet. Like, I haven't found one at all. Like, my registry is totally blank. Nicole has gotten a couple. Yeah. But. And I haven't really looked for them either. I just happened to find them while I was filling up on energy. <laughs> that works. Oh, wow. Whoa. Wow. So this is just, okay. The streets of Las Vegas changing constantly. Yeah. I can't believe how much they've done here. Oh, my gosh. Um, okay, so yeah, the, the first part of the Brilliant event starts Tuesday, and then it goes through, well, and then in the middle of that is Community Day, right? Yeah. The Sunday in the first week? Right. Because it was supposed to be in between. It was, but then they delayed the Brilliant event. Oh my god. Glitches and whatnot. So now, in the middle of the first week is Community Day, and then as soon as the first week ends, the second week starts. Yeah. It's kind of intense. And then... As soon as the second week ends, the third whatever event starts. The, <laughs> the Legends of Hogwarts. Yeah, the Legends of Hogwarts event, which is focused on one page, though. So, oh, I just got a sticker. Oh, there's a Hogwarts? Please? There was a Ginny. No, uh, Luna. Um, oh, yeah, Luna. No. <laughs> I don't need Ginny or Luna. Yeah, hey, neither do I. I need the DA dummy. That's what I need too. <laughs> Are you silver or gold? I'm, that's my only one that's still silver. Ah. Out of the easy pages at least. Okay, so my last one was... My last one to get gold. What was it? Oh, I think it was ministry because of the airplanes. Huh. Let's see. Yeah, because like most of them I have like almost done. Well, I don't know why. This is like the... This is the first page. Right. Technically, even though it's like down here, I don't know why they have that one up there. I know it bugs me. <laughs> um, which ones don't I have done? Oh, I need Neville too. I forgot. Go to the libraries. He's in the, one of the spawns at libraries. Yeah, that's oh, yeah, that's probably <laughs> what I should be doing. Well, because I want to get um, I want to get more rune stones too, yeah. so that I can finish that um, potions book mm -hmm. on the potions page, and then that way. I might be able to prestige twice when we have that event. Then I'd be able to get to gold, I think. I don't know. 
But yeah, Mike, uh, definitely put that on your calendar. I literally, I, as soon as I found out that there were so many things in a row, I actually did put them in my calendar. And I, I have like, I made a picture, like a photo too. Oh, that's okay. Um, like color coding the events so that I don't get them mixed up. Because it's a lot. I'm excited to have another Fortress Community Day though. Yes, definitely. Because what did you do for the first one? Um... That's when we met, all met up at Davis, and that's when I first met Erica. And we had okay. A, a really good oh, there's a big actually. group. Yeah. Yeah, I remember the picture because I was in Japan. Right. I was stuck in like a tiny little. It, it was like the size of a closet, and there were four <laughs> of us in there. It was me, Earl, uh, our friend Angela from uh, Rhode Island, and then Brishin. So the four of us were, were stuck in a little. It was like. It was weird. It was like a like it looked like a closet, but it had a little desk with a computer. It was like a like an internet cafe. Yeah. And um, it was just like kind of like just like a mattress on the floor, and you just sit there and you, like I don't know. They have like like movies and stuff you can watch, or like you can use the internet. It's interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. Japanese people. <laughs> <laughs> Mike said he looked up the information on the event yesterday, and he already forgot. It's a lot of information, so it is. Easy to forget. I'm like, I'm interested to see what they do in December too. Yeah. Cause like, Christmas is like the biggest thing, right? Mm -hmm. I don't know. It does. I don't know. It still seems kind of weird that they're doing the event at the end of the month too. It seems like out of place. A little somehow. bit. I don't know. And it's a full week too. Right. I thought it was gonna be. The, like a weekend or like a couple days, but we'll see. But yeah, uh, let's see. I usually talk strategy for for preparing for brilliant events. I think the potions thing is the biggest thing. I know you have to you have to brew two strongs and two potents, and I think you have to use three of each. So just make sure, I guess, make sure you have a couple extra on hand. I really don't ever want to deal with vampires ever again. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> I just want them for the oddity XP because I yeah. still need a bunch of oddity stones. I, I'm, I, for some reason I'm like hoarding them. I don't know why. And I don't know why I always click on oddities first when I need other stuff more. Yeah. Because I'm gold on both of those pages. Oh, so yeah, now it's just like casual. Yeah. Oh, but the new, on the new page, um, one of them is a, a fortress fragment, right? Yeah, the, the, the sign-up sign up sheet. sheet yeah. Okay. Have you tried to get one yet? No. No. <laughs> I was, I've been using my oddity stones because okay. I'm trying to get serpent eggs before my trip in December. Okay, fair enough. Oh yeah, and where are you going again? Um, a couple different places, Alabama, Virginia, North Carolina. Okay, so yeah, so all those places will have Should serpents. Should have serpents, yeah. Yeah, so for anybody who does have serpents stupid lucky people there's like the tiniest little area in the world that does not have them and vegas is right in the center of it right. like bits of california some of arizona all of nevada <laughs> yeah. it's still so irritating i think i need i'm on gold so at least i know that's not holding me back from anything but i think i need like 15 more to finish which I probably could have done during that event. But it's just so many tonics. <laughs> it is a lot of tonics. And I was having terrible luck getting some of my serpents. Like I ended up prestiging my other page with fluffy to silver because I got so many fluffy. Oh which, nice. Which is cool. Yeah, I didn't I I actually got I got less fluffy than I did serpents. Uh -huh. Okay, I guess just But I didn't even get that many of those because I, I think I ended up with I think I'm like halfway done with bronze. So like I think I have 15 on that one. Oh, okay. Let's see. Hmm. I haven't looked at I guess I should have looked at the second week of the Brilliant Event. Have you looked at those things yet? I just figure I like 
I wasn't going to remember anyway because um, I'm so focused on the first week. But there's not, most of it's pretty easy. Yeah. I think it's mostly just using the potion, brewing and using the potions, and then also mm-hmm. using dark detectors, which is the first time I've ever had Oh, that. yeah, that's true. I forgot about the dark detectors. But apparently they are more effective now than they were before. Yes, that was part of the update kind mm-hmm. of today, I guess. Because I saw Expecto Go um, posted a screenshot, and he had, like, an emergency and two severes and a high all on his screenshot at one time. Oh, wow. So I guess they're pretty good now. That's good. They should be. Right, they should have been from the get-go. Right. So, I kind of wonder, like, if... I don't know. I, I want to see, like, side-by-side side how effective three dark detectors is versus just one. Because uh-huh. if it's not worth dropping three, then that's, like, a, a big waste. <laughs> True. Especially if we're going to be doing stuff on Sunday. Yeah, so a big group of us in Las Vegas are going to a park with a a huge cluster of inns um, to do a dark detector party. So we've all been saving our dark detectors. I think I have like almost 50. I got one from a trace earlier today. Yeah, I have about 60 of them. Yeah, I think we all have about that much. I I just use them randomly, but not very often. them that much because I'm never in one place for long enough or if I am it's because I'm doing fortresses <laughs> right exactly so there's no point in using the dark detectors yeah oh centaur what do you still need on your on your um, oddities page um I still need centaurs and then centaur bows of course but okay. that one's gold and then for my other one it's on silver and I still need everything except for Urkling, so the Doxy, the oh my god. Eggs, and Leprechauns, which we haven't had a cloudy day in a while. So. Oh my god, <laughs> the one day that we did, I freaked out, because <laughs> I was waiting on one for so long. Uh, yeah. Hopefully we get a cloudy day between now and my trip so I can finish Yeah. You might even be likely to get a cloudy day there. True. Hey, Anthony Constance here. What's up? He's from Australia. How's it going? Are you the one that has found Fluffy? I think, I actually think he was the one with Fluffy. That's really cool. Anthony, did you, are you the one that found Fluffy? Because I need to know if it was, if it was on a tonic or if it was in the wild. Because I don't really want to use my tonics yet, but I will if I can get them for sure. Right. Ooh. Legends of Hogwarts. No! Another felch. <laughs> they both are felch. Oh my god. <laughs> this is my nightmare. All right. Also, I think I only need two more um, nifflers forever. Oh, wow. And I... It, the, these last ten have taken so long. Yeah. yeah, Anthony said both of them were wild. That's really cool. So that's really good information nice to know that they exist. Yeah, so I'm thinking maybe with this last update they went live. Maybe they just had them turned off for some reason. Yeah. Yeah, he said he didn't get them with a dark detector either. Awesome. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe we can get them with dark detectors on Sunday. It's possible. If dragons can spawn from them, I would think Fluffy could. Oh yeah, that's right. I've been seeing a lot more dragons lately, actually. Me too. I don't know. I don't think it's because of the weather, because it's just been clear like usual. Mm -hmm. We always have clear weather. You're right. Sadly. Um, Someone posted foggy weather I saw on Twitter. That's the first time I've seen it. They posted this screenshot, and it had, like, you know how each one has, like, something in the image? Right. Um, It just had, like, six or seven Dementors in the fog on the thing. So I wonder, like, if all those ones spawn more frequently. It doesn't seem like the weather affects it that much, though. No, just a little bit. Okay, so this parking lot has usually a lot of spawns. Alrighty. This is the parking lot. (laughs) Parking lots are always the good places to go. Right. 
It's just, this is like a weird one because it's in the middle of nothing. True. But yeah, it's usually pretty good. So wait, so we've seen Fluffy. Have we, we haven't seen the escapee or the Death Eater, right? Nobody's seen any of those? Not that I know of. Ooh, there's another Legends. It's fireworks. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm never going to find one. <laughs> and this is the only place that I know of around here with a flagged Hogwarts area. Yeah. Because I don't think there's a library nearby, is there? I don't think so, no. Yeah, Anthony said Dementors in Fog look awesome. He said he doesn't get fog too much either. That's like, that's like the rarest weather. I'm actually surprised, even in Pogo, like I was surprised when weather came out that foggy was a weather type. Because it just, mm -hmm. how often is it even foggy yeah. anywhere? There was one time when I was in LA and like in the morning it was foggy in Pogo. Was, really? Yeah, it was really weird. Yeah, I think even in Michigan, I saw it two or three times and like it's it's sometimes foggy there but even when it is it doesn't show it like it would be snowy or windy or whatever instead yeah i'm gonna pay more attention to my masterfuls i don't know if you saw everybody posting on twitter like what's your masterful streak i have no idea like the most you've ever gotten in a row oh not that many <laughs> I don't really even try for them. I just, you know, try yeah. to do the best I can. I think if the if the counter would still count up, I'd care more. Right. But it's sad that you don't get to see any of that anymore. Right. They took it away. I know. Oh, I can't go this way. <laughs> Oops. Oh, they do a food truck thing. That's why. Okay, turning around. That would be cool if one of the... I mean, I say it would be cool now until I can't do it. Oh, Holly is texting me. Holly, I can't talk. I'm streaming. Um, it would be cool if that was one of the uh, assignment tasks was to get, like, five Masterfuls in a row. Because, you know, in Pogo, there's yeah. three excellence. Oh, there's a, a horn here. No. Oh, well. Oh, I'm walking back to it now. Come back. Oh, well. Oh, there it is. Hey. Always something happening here. I know. It's also Friday night. Yeah. Uh, Rob says he misses knowing his masterful percentage. When the when the game first started, we were constantly sharing like our percentage. I think the highest that I was at was like nineteen percent, mm -hmm. and then the numbers went away. I waited to up to update the app for so long until it forced it because I wanted to keep saying it but oh well rip yeah. Rob what was your number at you were at like like th like 30% or something for a while which was kind of nuts but yeah now I'd like to see because like now I do them by accident like when I'm <laughs> playing with one hand I'm like oh Oh, so how many books do you have left? Do you know for your uh, profession? Let's see. I think forty-six. Oh my god! I think we're even now. So Nicole and I are <laughs> are fake racing to to finish our professions. Uh, she's a magizoologist, so she needs like a hundred more books than I do. But now I think we're about even on what we need still under 50 I know for sure I think I'm at like I don't know if I'm at 45 or 46 left but 
Calvin says his masterful ratio is like 35 to 40 percent. I don't believe that. Wow. I think you're lying. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> I don't know why they turned it off either. I know. <laughs> I don't know just, the game doesn't like numbers because it caps everything. Like, yeah. Like 65 rank. And... Well, hopefully that means that they're just going to like keep pumping out stuff, which so far it seems like they are. Right. Because I was worried about finishing foundable pages and then they're like okay here's another one here's another one I'm like, okay <laughs> that's fine then yeah anthony and mike both say that their percentages would be horrible because they don't pay attention <laughs> yeah that's me i pay attention sometimes there was one time i was walking around <laughs> mike says calvin's lying too that's i totally believe that calvin you're lying um, there was one time I was walking around and I, th I, I must have gotten like 10 in a row, like just not even paying attention. I was like, okay, maybe I'm playing this too much. <laughs> also just depends on what trace it is too. Some of them are easier than others. Yeah, Calvin was just saying the M always messes him up. Yeah. I don't like the M. The E, this one, is the first one that I masterfold. I remember I was so happy because I couldn't do <laughs> uh, it. And Aguamenti is really easy too. But yeah, I don't like the Incendio, the A. Oh, yeah, I think that one's my worst one. That is definitely the worst. Like, I, it's like just pure luck if I get a Masterful on that one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, these portraits. <laughs> I should just use a potion. Mm -hmm. Just got a level 5 stone. Oh, nice. That's what I really need. See, that, ugh. Because I don't want to use my dark arts ones if I don't have to. I want to use stuff that I need fragments for. Right. For community day. So what I really want to do is keep farming stuff. It departed on me. Um, keep farming stuff so I can get more fives. Let's see. Am I going to get a five? Oh, I got a four. That's okay. Still pretty good. Reb said he got to about 32% before it got taken away. That's crazy. Yeah, what was Katie at? He said Katie was giving him a run for his money. Let's see. I want to go a different way. Get some different fragments. I'm cool with whatever. I'm okay. spinning ends and catching what I can. Yep. Oh yeah, Calvin said he's been looking at, at the Wizards Unite game guides to see which um, pages haven't been released yet. That's actually a good idea because somebody somebody found one in one of the books oh, okay. showing something that wasn't released. <laughs> like kind of how the, the, what do you call it, the trailer for the game um, showed the Dark Witch. Right. And we didn't get that until Halloween. Mm -hmm. So at least we'd know it's coming, not that we'd know when, but... Another Hogwarts. Ah, Ginny. I don't need her. No. <laughs> that was funny though for the for the whole Halloween event, like with the basilisk and stuff. For the longest time I didn't even consider the <laughs> like the reason why they chose Myrtle and Ginny. <laughs> I think Wizard News said the same thing in his video. Like, like one duh. video, he's like, why are they choosing those? And, like, his next video is like, oh, yeah, the castle. <laughs> right. <laughs> so I actually appreciate it more. Right. Because it's actually thoughtful. Oh, gosh. Shane is in here. Hello, Shane. <laughs> Hi. Since you're just joining us, I will tell you. Nicole is with me. We are looping downtown, so you're missing it. Um... We're looking for the new stuff. Waiting for the flu powder game. What flu powder game? Anthony said he's looking, he's waiting for a flu powder game. I don't know what that means. I mean, I know what flu powder is, but I don't know what that means. Something, it's an Australian secret. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're in, in downtown Las Vegas, just looping, looking for 
Legends of Hogwarts spawns. I want the new ones, but we have found zero so far. So I'm still clicking on every single one I find, getting a lot of filch, getting some chickens on fire, but nothing I want. Oh well. Should probably delete some items. I'm just brewing just tonics right now. Mm -hmm. I'm still brewing droddles. Yeah, I have 16. I'm probably going to do a couple more, but we'll see. I guess I don't need to delete items yet. Anthony, what is this flu powder game? I don't know what this is. I need to know. Oh, Team Ron, Team Harry, Team Hermione with the early data mines. I remember hearing about that, and then I completely forgot. Did you ever hear about that? What was that? It was like like three different teams. I don't... Oh, no, I don't think so. I, I didn't know anything about this game until it came out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's a bunch of us. We made a chat so long ago. That's actually the chat that you're in now. It's okay. like when it was just rumors and stuff like before there was a release date we were like we made a chat and we put all the information we could find on it cool yeah that sounds like fun that was a while ago yeah and then it came out in australia and new zealand and we had a couple people playing anthony's been playing for a while that's cool yeah i don't i don't know anything about it besides those those team names now that you said it i remember but it's been such a long time since I've heard anything about it. If anybody has any details from data mine at all, I would be very interested in knowing about that. Oh my gosh, I'm unlocking so many porkies. Same. Yes. I was about to, I might need to start opening them. Yeah, I'm gonna need to too. At least you can click on one and exit now. Yeah, that's true. Erica just found that out like two days ago. I she was like... Yeah, I still like to click on them. I do if I'm walking, yeah. <laughs> it's fun. Like, it's, it's fun to like, I don't know, instead of just seeing it, to actually like see what you're getting as you're getting it. But, like, if I'm on a brain elixir, then I don't because it's just faster to just do it and move on. Right. I think that's like that's like my favorite feature in the game though. Like when people ask like how the game is, I always like open up a porky and show them. Yeah, that's good. That's a good way to show them like what it's yeah. all about. Like it's not just like clicking on your screen. Cuz it feels like you're really there. <laughs> it took me so long to get these and now that I've gotten all of them that I need, I see them everywhere. Yeah, that's how this game is a lot. So like, <laughs> like once you don't need it anymore, it shows up everywhere. I wonder if that's on purpose. <laughs> I feel like it has to be. <laughs> Maybe. Uh oh, Rob asked where my brain elixir is. Who am I? I'm a person grinding XP without a brain elixir. That's who I am. Yeah. I don't have 60 of them, but I do have like 40 brain elixirs, so I should probably use some. I actually when what was, it was a community day the last time mm -hmm. with the 30 minute elixirs. I only brewed, well it's 15 minutes with the master, master notes. notes, yeah. But I only brewed whatever in the time. I didn't pay for any to finish or anything, because I felt like that would be too much. It just takes up too much space. doing which is using them when I was using tonics to go through them because I brewed so many on community day. Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah I'll, I use them when I walk at the apartment complex because I can get non-stop spawns. Right. Like right now there's nothing on my screen. Uh -huh. but. I wish it was Tuesday. I know. Like we need our event. Yeah. I, f 
finally started using my event rune stones from the last Brilliant event. I had 180, 170 of them. And it took me 40 of them to get the book that I needed in my wizarding challenge page. So now all three of my pages are gold. I think I'm kind of close to halfway done with gold on all of them. So that's good. But that's what it's actually good for. Nicole taught me that. <laughs> to use, sorry, to use the uh, event room stones to do the lower level chamber so you're not wasting the other family ones that you really need fragments for um, so that you can get all your challenge pages done in the lower chambers because you can only get the books basically from the ruins pages yep. I think there's a, a couple books you can get from low towers but for the most part it's just yeah like ruins one through three pretty much yeah um, but I think there's a there's one in the not the joke pages, but what's the one before the joke pages? The one before the joke pages are the book pages. Oh, then after. The one with the, like, not the, I guess it's the emblems. I think that's the, just like the emblems and stuff is what it's called. Yeah, I don't or know the what magical call it. devices. I don't know, one of those. I think, actually, I think the pages are called different things. But yeah, there's one thing in there that I need before I can prestige to gold, but other than that. finally working on that stuff. I was so focused on foundables for so long that I didn't, like I didn't even get the full use out of the uh, fan fest because there were so many things that I needed fortress fragments for and I didn't think about it ahead of time because I didn't realize how much stuff was going to be there. Right. Oh man, like I could have been done with bronze on Dumbledore and like <sighs> so much wasted. Well, now we know for next year's fan fest. Right. Have yeah. All your, your <laughs> fragments done. I would definitely say after going to fan fest once, like I don't I couldn't miss another one. Like if there was another one, I would have to go to that one too. Right. It's worth it. And Indianapolis was actually a great place for it. Like the the park that it was at was so nice and it was huge. And they had like a bridge over like a river. Uh, and just like they had so many different areas. It was awesome. Yeah, this whole area is a uh, mysterious artifacts. Yeah, I've seen flag. lots of different nests. There's also Wonders of the Wizarding World. Uh -huh. There was a Dark Arts that we passed. Yep. Yeah, Dark Arts is down here. Which was nice. And there goes another port key. All of my 2Ks are going so fast. Um, Rob says, Who is this Nicole? I don't want to embarrass her, but I do. <laughs> Where did you meet her? What's her favorite color? What house is she? And does she like turtles? Um, yeah, I like turtles. My favorite <laughs> color is pink. Um, my house is Ravenclaw. Did I get all of them? Um, who are you? Um, I'm Nicole. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very existential question. Yeah, it is. Um, <laughs> who am I? I don't even know. Yeah. And, um, I met Melissa for the first time grinding fortresses. Yeah. Because I got added to the, like, Las Vegas chat by Erica during that, that community day for the last one for, um, Fortress Battles. So we were like in the same chat, and so eventually, you know, we planned to meet up and finally yeah. met each other. <laughs> like the Las Vegas crew, we are like all about fortresses. I've been learning, like the more that I've been talking about fortress battles with people, that most people don't do that. Like most communities aren't grinding fortresses the way we do. Like a lot of people haven't even gotten to Dark Five, and that's like the only thing we do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think last Sunday we did like, I don't know, 25 or so Dark Fives. Yeah. And like, it, pretty easily also. I mean, also Melissa was using 100 potions. <laughs> <laughs> but it, that made it so much more worth it. Like, yeah. now I know, like, because we have to do that for Community Day. Oh, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Clay says, Ravenclaw, and somehow I knew you liked pink. <laughs> hmm, how did you guess? Yeah, my hair is pink, so if you're in that chat, you could probably see my picture. <laughs> I 
it just occurred to me that I'm like doing the worst choices of all time. Like, I mean, you're driving and doing a live stream, yeah. so I think it's okay. <laughs> but like everyone can see my phone screen, but they can't see what else I'm doing. Right, so. that's all they can <laughs> Don't see. Don't judge me. <laughs> Yeah, Mike says we just have more hardcore people in our community. But that's because we all build each other up. Yeah. Like, we had new people come the last couple, those, what, two weeks. Like, brand new people playing the game. So it's hard. Um, okay, Anthony says they do a lot of fortresses in Melbourne. That's good. But yeah, it's, it's hard when people are new because it's like, what do you even... Yeah, it's it, like we're like, doing Dark Fives and like they just barely unlocked like Ruins 5 on their own. Right. <laughs> so I mean like I want to help them. It's just like it, we're hurting ourselves by helping them because yeah. you know, we're doing lower chambers and stuff. I think ultimately like when somebody's new, I think it's easier to, to be one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah. Yeah, instead of with the whole group. You know, like especially if you have to explain stuff like, you know, what the up arrow and down arrow is and you know, like... When we say using charms, like what that means. <laughs> right. Okay. Okay, yeah, so he said in Winnipeg they've got some people too. Um, the highest order, I think he said, is level 48. That's oh, good though. That's pretty good. Like anything over 40, I'd say right now, is pretty good. Oh, yeah. Definitely. But like also, this game is so much different because like your level doesn't matter so much. Right. I don't know. Most games, the level matters, but it's way like your profession grade is way more important. Right. I mean, your level does make catching confoundables easier. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I'm in the wrong place, aren't I? Oh yeah. I'm surprised. Usually they have. Usually there's um. Food trucks here by now. Oh, there's a muffler. Oh my gosh, is there really? Yes. I need this so bad. Me too. Oh my gosh, I need one more after this. I had one earlier depart on me. So oh no. I'm like... Oh gosh. <laughs> oh gosh, it's resisting. <laughs> <laughs> Every time that happens, like if I click and it doesn't click, I'm like, oh god. Like now, again. There we go, I got mine on the third cast. This is my third cast, so we shall see. Nope, I didn't. Okay. Ah, I got it. Okay, Yay. I need one more. Wow. Forever. Forever! <laughs> <laughs> Erica hasn't needed them in so long, so when I'm playing with her, like, I'll click on one and I'll be like, oh my god, a niffler, and she's like, I know. <laughs> Why did you say anything? Yeah, so Rob says that he doesn't, he's never done a Dark Five, but there's not really much of a community there, which I can actually say because he lives where I used to live. It's harder there. Yeah. Oh, wow. Um, Anthony says that he's got a, a few people there with um, level or grade 15 profession. Wow. That's better, pretty cool. Better than us. <laughs> yeah. We're almost there. Yeah, we're almost we're there. We're going to be the first two. Yeah, I know. I'm very excited. I, know, I feel bad for the professors because they're just waiting on uh, restricted books. I know, it's not fair. I know. Because Sam would be right there with us, pretty much. Yeah. He's just waiting on restricted books. Right. Hi, Holly's in the chat. Hi, Holly. She says, happy Friday. Happy Friday, Holly. I saw you texted me and I said, I, I said out loud, not to you, but I said out loud, I was like, I can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> We're just driving around downtown. You should come join us. Yeah, it's Saturday afternoon in Australia, that, which doesn't exist. Yeah. There's a whole Facebook group uh, committed to spreading the truth. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, Rob, what is your profession grade right now? Because you're probably the highest in Michigan, I would assume. Because we know people from other communities, but... They're not really playing as hard as you are. 
So I'm just going to assume that you're the highest there, unless Chris is playing a lot. So I think me and you are probably the highest in Vegas. I, I would imagine if we if there was anybody else in Vegas playing as much as we are that we would know about them by now. Right. Probably. I feel like it'd be pretty hard not to have found us by now. Mm -hmm. Between like the big parks that we go to and stuff. Yes, Rob, there are two Anthony's in Australia. At least two. <laughs> probably more. <laughs> <laughs> Getting to get energy. I'm like, oh, there was a Neville. Really? Yeah, you might have been driving past it by now. Oh, oh. Yeah! Oh, that was pretty good. Aha! I got a masterful on that one. It happens more when you're like not paying attention right. sometimes. <laughs> when you're not trying your hardest. <laughs> right. Holly, we're downtown. Downtown Las Vegas. Come join us. We're just driving around trying to find the new stuff. There's a new page of foundables that just came out today. Yeah. And there's four new ones. There's... I don't even know what they all are. It's Angelina. There's Fred and George. Yeah, Fred and George? Yeah. Okay, I saw George. I didn't see Fred. Yeah, they ran their sweaters with F and G, so... Okay. You know who's who. Right, yeah. Yeah, I saw George with it was like, oh how do you know? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so that was smart of them. Um, I'm not sure what the fourth one is. I don't know what the fourth one is either. I think it's some other chick. I don't know. Some I, other <laughs> chick. That's what it I, says on right on the page. I really like rewatch the movies, reread the books, and like refresh myself with all the characters and stuff. <laughs> Yeah, me too. I actually, I found on, have you ever used Sporkle? Like, it's like a trivia It doesn't sound familiar. Thing. It's like, it's a it's a site where you can do quizzes and okay. stuff. And they have it, a lot of, one like, people, like, create them and submit them. Okay. And there's one for the top 200 Harry Potter characters by mentions in the books. And you have, like, 15 minutes. And I tried it the other day, and I got 110. It's hard, though, because, like, you know, you get the first, like, 30 or 40, and then it's like, okay, now you have to really think. Right. Um, I think Erica got, like, 40-something. <laughs> oh, wow. But somebody on Twitter said that they got 146 or something like that. That's a lot. Oh, yeah. Because some of them are, like really obscure. obscure yeah like like um neville's aunt right they were like mentioned once yeah <laughs> like 200 people is a lot of people it is but maybe i'll show the link and see what you guys can do because <laughs> yeah. i put it on twitter but i didn't share it in chat it's fun though especially but i don't know i think having like a timer on it made me nervous <laughs> and i forgot uh, yeah like, I spent a really long time trying to think of the Slytherin Quidditch captain's name. Marcus Flint took me a really long time. I was really proud of myself when I finally thought of it. It sounds familiar that you say that, but I would yeah. never want to come up with that on my own. Yeah. <laughs> like, I went through, like, like, I was like, okay, in year one, what are the names that, that McGonagall is, like, calling out for the sorting hat? And I was like, okay, in year two... Okay, I, was, I went through all the, like, the teachers, and then I went through all the, the Quidditch players, like, in each house that I could remember, uh -huh. and then, like, the Triwizard Tournament, like, all the people from the other schools, and then the Ministry of Magic. There's too many people. Uh-huh, a lot of them, especially in the Ministry. But yeah, you don't even realize how much information is stored in your head from this fake thing. Right, this whole universe. It's been a lot of ambulances today. I, I saw like three when I first got down here. Oh wow. Yeah, and they were all going in different directions, so. Just people doing stupid stuff probably. I guess so. Getting too drunk. Right. <laughs> Vegas. Yeah.
So Rob said he's grade 13.5. So that's actually, that's good. He said he's been slacking, but that's not really slacking. No, that's pretty good. And he's a Magizoo. Oh, yeah. So. And it's even harder for us. Mm -hmm. so. Yeah, I know he does He does a lot of fortresses with his roommate. Okay. So that's good. Like, the, the friend bonus is huge. Yeah, even just having one person with yeah. you, as long as they're a different profession, makes it so much easier mm -hmm. and nicer. Like, I think my favorite, oh, before I say mine, what do you think the best pairing is for two professions? My opinion? Uh, I don't know. Definitely Magizu and one of the others. <laughs> Just because the power of reviving, you know? Mm -hmm. um, but I don't know. Magizu or Or, Magizu Professor, it's I'm not sure. What do you think? I think Magizu and Or is the best. Okay. Because, um... For sure, when I play with Erica, it turns into a disaster if we do a higher chamber because yeah. she's a professor, I'm an Auror, and we just die. Yep. And then it's like, okay, can we afford to die or do I need to use health potions? Either way, it sucks because then you have to wait. Yep. Um, thanks for hanging out, Anthony. Talk to you later. Good luck playing. Have a good night. Good day. Day. You're on <laughs> it's show, Saturday. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have a good so time. Weird. Right. <laughs> yeah, because we're like all the way in the west. Like there's only one time zone west of us, I believe. No, two time zones west of us. Yeah. Like They're Alaska like all Hawaii. the way east. Yep, yep, yep. I know. I should know that from when I'm watching Zoe's um, live streams. I was watching her live stream the other day doing Team Rocket. And yeah. It was like whatever, like the nighttime and it was the daytime of her. Yeah, it was like day. 11 a.m. for her. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I saw she, when she put it on Twitter, she actually put the different time zones. Like, oh, okay. I feel like nobody knows Australia's time zone. So she's like, <laughs> if you're here, it's this time. <laughs> if you're here, it's this time. Right. That's got to be hard, though. Because most people watching oh, oh, are... there was a new Legend oh, of my Hogwarts. Oh, my gosh. Angelina. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> yeah! Finally! It's been, what, like an hour? <laughs> right. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I'm going to get it. And it's an M, too. I don't like that. I know. Oh, mine departed. Oh, no. <laughs> now that made me nervous. Uh-oh. At least I've already gotten to her earlier. <sighs> I'm, like, holding my breath. No! You can do it. Oh, gosh. Ooh, that was a really bad kiss. <laughs> no. Can't look. Oh, I got it. Oh, I forgot you can't skip it on your first one. That's right. I was like clicking through it and I was like, oh, I must not have gotten it, but I forgot the I, very first one you can't skip. I noticed that earlier today too. I was like, why won't it let me skip? And like, because I was like, I remember it doesn't let you do it on the first one. Yay! Finally. Okay, so now I have one. <laughs> so it looks like she's the common one. Yeah. Well, because that, yeah, th that one's medium and the rest of them, there's one high and two severe. So I feel like we're probably not going to see the severe ones without dark detectors. Yeah. Other than for the that, most part. The rare one here and there. Yeah. I wonder if the libraries are spawning them. I don't know. We could maybe check it out. I'm not sure where to go. That would be close to here, though. Yeah, I don't know either. Hmm. I don't think there's a library near here that would be... involved in International Games Week. Well, that's exciting. I got one. Yeah. That was the goal. At least you got one. Yeah, so that, that shows that just because it's new doesn't mean that it's everywhere. Yeah, Clay, so, yeah, you can't skip at, uh, skip past on the very first one of a foundable that you find. Which I think is cool, because, like, it's still making you watch the animations that are super cool. But... At least once, yeah. Uh, Mike said I gotta keep spinning in. Shut up, I have 500 energy. I'm opening four keys, because I unlocked all of them in one. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting pretty close to I think I have two more. The one I have left is a 10k though. I'm excited to see. Oh, nice. Yeah, I opened four 10ks last week at once. And, and nothing good. I did nothing that I <laughs> needed at all. It was all stuff I already had. <laughs> Not even a Niffler. I'm getting a couple of things that I still need, but it's mostly the the not so rare rares, you know, uh -huh. like the paper airplanes. And stuff. Right.
outside, like the middle. Yeah. And also, most of these are 2Ks, so like, they're nothing that good. <laughs> yeah. 2Ks are good though, because they're just so fast. Yes. And you still get items that you need and stuff. Rob says every time we say port keys, he hears porkies. <laughs> Isn't that a cute. movie? Um, probably. I, I think so. Like porky pig. Port key pig. <laughs> I think Steve actually calls them porkies. Huh, that's kind of cute. <laughs> Who was it? Somebody took a picture of... Oh, there's another Angelina. <gasps> Is there? Yeah! I didn't even see it there. Yay! Good looking out. <laughs> I'm trying. If I... Oh my gosh, it started parted again. <laughs> okay. It doesn't like you. Apparently. You can only have one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, two. You got two. two. Yeah, I got two. You can only have two. So then I should get this one. Okay, if, if it's com if this common, eventually I'll, I'll get 12, not too bad. Yeah. It'll be forever before I get this. Series. Right. Okay, Clay said Porgies is an 80s movie, so I was right. I've never seen it, but. Yeah. Ooh, I think I got a masterful. Yeah. And I got it. Yeah. So now we're tied. All right, there we go. Oh, there's two highs here. What are they? Ooh, I need this because I prestiged. Yeah, I need these guys too. Are they the same? I don't know. I got Tonks on one of them. Yeah, me too. Sweet! They're both Tonks. Alright. Finally getting stuff we need. Yeah. That's good. Oh, what I was going to say earlier, um, Shane was talking the other day about uh, now that the potions carry over mm -hmm. between foes, he was saying as an Auror in the beginning of a fortress to drop a potent and just go in and do first strike on everything. Oh. That's the smartest wow. thing I've ever heard. Yeah. <laughs> no, it totally is. Wow. Because, Because yeah. then that way you're not wasting anything and right. you're getting that first hit with, with the fifty percent increase uh, and on your crit and all, with all Yeah, the stuff. all the bonuses. Huh. So if you do five then you're that that's like the maximum use that you could possibly get off of a potent. Yep. Yep. So yeah it's that like blew my mind. The aura's potion. Yeah. So I think I wanna try that. Yeah. Probably for community day. Like, think if we keep using potions, we can do a lot of damage. Oh like, I didn't even mean that to be a pun. <laughs> but like, we can go through so many fortresses. <laughs> no, we can, yeah. But yeah. I know, it's like funny when I use a potion, like on like an Urkling, because I have like the extra power on Urkling, so I just like go through them in like one or two hits with a potent. Right. <laughs> Well, yeah, that's the thing, because I was like, okay, it's cool. Oh, um, Clay says, has anyone found any of the new foundables in Port Keys? I don't... I haven't seen anybody who's said that yet. Um, I feel also like Orange Wizard would have updated that, but I don't know for sure. We passed a Hogwarts thing, but I didn't Yeah, I got stuck it. on the end. Okay. I think I'm going to have to restart. <laughs> Yeah, I, I had to restart twice already. Oh, well. Yeah, I haven't I haven't seen anybody say that they got any in port keys. But the port key fragments are so limited, I wouldn't be surprised if they weren't in them. Right. Okay, I'm going to go a different way this time. Oh, here's another Legends. The chicken. <laughs> I do like all the chicken. I don't like. Was there ever a chicken in any of the movies? Not that I remember. But like, maybe I'm just forgetting something. I don't know. 
Does anybody remember a chicken <laughs> in any Harry Potter movie? Or, uh, I guess... Um, Fantastic Beasts. Right. But I don't think that's a Fantastic Beast. I think it's just a chicken. <laughs> yeah, it looks like just a chicken. I watched the... Have you seen the Fantastic Beast movies? Yes. Okay. I was going to say, I watched the first one on an airplane. And I haven't seen the second one. You should. It's really good. Is it? Yeah. I never heard anybody talk about it. But I need to watch it, I guess. Ooh, 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 ooh. There was an emergency over there. Oh, I didn't see it. I didn't click on it. It disappeared. Okay. We're going to get an emergency. Emergency. Calvin says no chicken. I didn't think so. I don't even know what it is. It's a uh, games and sports. So what's the games and sports emergency? Oh, quitted or uh, yeah, quitted Harry. Do you need that? I think I need one more. So if that's what it is, that's exciting. Let's see. Should be in here somewhere. Um, just a couple oddities. I don't even know if I can go in here, but I'm going to. Yeah, I'll just park here. Yeah, you know. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I always say, what's the worst that could happen? I have to leave. They tell leave. you to leave. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, where is it? I'm going to lose it. Everybody saw that on my screen. I know they did. I, except for me. <laughs> it didn't show up on my screen. <laughs> Because it showed up and then it disappeared. Yeah. Okay. okay. It could have literally just despawned as you saw it's it. It's possible, but that would... That would it's too suck. painful. <laughs> <laughs> it was like almost right where we are. Hmm. I'm going to do one more loop around. I believe you. I just... <laughs> this game is really fun. Like it's weird with how things spawn so yeah i don't like the radius thing i don't like that it can be in a whole area yeah well i just like don't like when you're sitting next to somebody and you see something and they don't and like you have to walk to find it or something like that right that's what i mean because it like it's like a it, within a circle it can yeah. spawn like even when you click on something and you back out and then you click on something else it's they're usually in different places right. doesn't make any sense it doesn't okay please be here i'm gonna actually i'm gonna go in here Oof. please be here oh there it is yeah it. Yeah! Quidditch Terry. Yep, 14 out of 15. It's my last one if I get it. Sweet! Woo. Use yep. a potion. <laughs> I, I a throttle and a strong. Perfect. I think I was gonna oh, my throttle to... worked. It oh, it the, said that? I the, haven't the, seen the that yet. denied. Oh, I gotta go out. Whatever, I gotta go out this way. Well, there we go. I've seen that happen a couple times, but yeah, oh, I there we go. And I got it on the yet. second cast. Place image. Woohoo. Nice. Cool. Now I just need a boatload of Goblet of Fires. <laughs> actually been getting a lot of centaurs today. Yeah, I'm, I'm always down for oddities just because they're one hit for the most part mm -hmm. and um, they're oddities, so they're cool. Yeah, I need hmm, like 25 more. When I was in Michigan, actually, they were everywhere all day long, like Ooh, interesting. during the daytime, which we never see. Yeah, we don't see them during the daytime here. Yeah, until I went there, I didn't even realize that you could see them during the day. Yeah. I don't know. Hmm. All right, so I think I am going to end the live stream in about three minutes. We'll make it four minutes. We'll do 
835. Oh, I need this thingy. I need so 9 much. out of 12. Uh, 8 out of 12. Who's gonna get it? <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I'm still trying. But yeah, I'll go for a couple more minutes and then I'm gonna finish up. Nicole and I are gonna finish up our grind for a little bit, but I'm gonna end the stream in three minutes now. <laughs> so if you have anything exciting or shocking to say, do it right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is this. Speak now or forever hold your peace? Yes. Confess your deepest, darkest secret. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing illegal. <laughs> uh, is this a niffler? No, it's a baby niffler. I have a baby niffler in my car. It's so cute. Oh, you're right. Yeah, Earl oh, gave it to me. So cute. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Get some energy. Oh, so. Let's see, today's Friday. So Sunday we're doing a dark detector party. Yep. And then Tuesday is when the event starts at 11 a.m. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rob said, you're lucky you like turtles, but eh, Ravenclaw. <laughs> Rob's a Gryffindor. Okay, well. So nobody likes Gryffindor. I don't know. Harry's the worst character in the whole <laughs> series, so sorry, Rob. Actually, I think Ravenclaw is the most liked out of all the houses. Yeah. It's the least represented. Like, how many Ravenclaws can you name? Um, Cho two? Chang. Yeah. And Luna Lovegood. Oh yeah, I forgot Luna Love. Wait, is she? Yep. Hmm. Oh, I'm full on energy now. Fire breathing chickens are found in the Wizarding World Wiki. Clay just found it. <laughs> Interesting. See, so this is what we're closing with. Fire chickens are really in the Wizarding World and they blow up fireworks. <laughs> so now we know for sure via Clay. So if he's if if it's wrong, then that's his information, not mine. <laughs> Ooh, see, I'm on my hundredth centaur. Cool. So I need twenty more. Yeah, you're. I'm like at seventy something. Okay. All right, less than one minute, and I'm ending the stream. So thank you guys for joining. Once again, it's me and Nicole, downtown Las Vegas. We finally got some of the new Legends of Hogwarts foundables. Finally, we yeah. got two of them. We got some other stuff we needed, but that was cool. Um, but yeah, thanks for coming out to, to grind with us. And uh, I will probably stream again before the event starts. So hmm, maybe on Sunday when we do our Dark Detector party. So if anybody's interested in, in a, checking out what we get from Dark Detectors, I might stream a little bit of that. Probably not too long, but because that'll be chaotic to be streaming and yeah. getting all that crazy stuff too. Hopefully crazy stuff. But yeah, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for tuning in for the first time in uh, at least a month. But I'm going to try to be around more. So you guys have a good night. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.